In this video, you will learn how to create a donor chart in Canva. And fortunately, you don't have to install any third-party app or plugin to create this nice design. And as you can see, the, the chart is a bit more interactive. You can hover above it and later you can change the color or the value of each part of the chart. So here's how you can create one. Let's add a new page and go to elements. The one that you want to insert is a donor chart. On the chart section, you want to click see all and select a donor chart. Canva will give you this basic template which we can modify later. So I'm going to remove all the value, remove all the labels, click clear data. And let's say I'm going to populate this chart with my activity throughout the day. Let's call this label activity. And this one is going to be value or let's say how many hours I need to finish the activity or the task. Let's say this one is sleeping for eight hours and this is working for eight hours. And there's also commuting for two hours and entertainment for let's say also two hours learning learning for two hours and others for two hours so in total sorry about that in total there is 24 hours and canva will automatically aggregate or calculate the number and turn that into a percentage so sleeping is 33 percent which is roughly about one third of a day so that makes a lot of sense by the way i think it's worth mentioning that you can also add data from google sheets or if you have a document from your computer you can upload it here and that data will be turned into this beautiful donor chart and the next thing that you can do is changing the color of the element in your donor chart let's say i want to change this color of sleeping uh, it's light blue and i don't like it i want to turn something that is more appropriate to do that you can click on the chart and click on the color that you want to change and let's say i'm going to select black because it's sleeping it's it's night so i think it's appropriate to use this dark color you can do the same for other elements of the chart and by the way, if you want to get something prettier, I do recommend to use a template from many professionals that have created really, really good design by utilizing donut charts in Canva. You can use a keyword like donut chart and you will see a lot of beautiful design that you could incorporate into your document. So this is one way to, to get a pretty document without having to spend too much time on designing. In any case, I hope you find this video helpful and I'll see you on the next video.